Alright, this is going to be a quick tutorial on how to attach your Sinwing 6 to your AV200. First, you're going to start off by grabbing your Sinwing 6 and you're going to turn it upside down. Now, you can see that there's going to be thumb screws and washers. You want to be careful because there's actually washers in between the thumb screw and this metal washer. So, when you unscrew it, make sure you turn it together and hold it up. So, once it's unscrewed, Make sure that the post is still on there. So, once the post is on there, take your isolated bushing, put one on top, and then remove the next three and repeat the same process. Alright, once they're on, you're going to take your AV200 and you're going to mount it through the holes. So, as you can see, there's holes in. If you have a hard time putting it in, you can always put the isolated bushings in the carbon plate first and then put them onto the post so it will slide in a little easier. So, once it's on, what we're going to do is just make sure that all the bushings are all the way through. So, once we're done with that, we'll grab our isolated washers. And what we're going to do is we're going to put the rings around the isolated bushing that is sticking out. So, as you can see, I'll kind of wrap it around here. And repeat the process for all of them. Once you're finished, you're going to take your thumb screw and your washer, you're going to push it against the isolated and screw it down. And this is going to sandwich the isolated bushing and the isolated washer together against the plate to hold the plate down firmly, but give it enough cushion, so uh, just tighten it down with your hand. Once you're done tightening down, make sure, again, they're all tightened down pretty well. Um, just hand tight is fine. And then you've successfully attached your AV200 gimbal to the Sinowing 6.